All right, so I talked about the amygdala, the reptilian part of your brain, the fight or flight aspect of your brain, but there's an actual opposite aspect of your brain, the neocortex. It's called the neocortex because it's the most uh, newest part of your brain to evolve. Check out this. This is a good definition. Definition of the neocortex. The newer portion of the cerebral cortex that serves as the center of higher mental functions for humans. Contains over billions of cells, each with, oh, the la 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 has over, you know, it goes on and on, the size and thickness of a formal dinner napkin. The cells in the neocortex are arranged in six layers within which different regions permit vision, hearing, touch, the sense of balance, movement, emotional responses, and every other feat of cognition. Every other feat of cognition. Wouldn't you rather just live in the neocortex? It's just, it's, it's, it's everything that's human about you. Um, nobody has it as advanced as the humans. Ours is all wrinkly and, 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 and it's, just, it's, it's just so vital in us. It is what makes us human. But so often we get caught in other parts of our brain, lower, more, less evolved aspects of our brain that don't allow us to be thinking right. And so when you're considering this, when you feel anxiety and frustration and fear, it's not your neocortex. Your neocortex wants you to be relaxed and chilled out so that you can think about things holistically and use it to its full ability. You want to be in your neocortex. I know you don't like feeling fear, right? You don't like it. But I know you live there. I know you're in there. And I know that a lot of people live there a lot. When you're feeling fear, when you're feeling anxiety, it is that reptilian amygdala part of your brain that's just trying to reach out, being like, hey, man, this could be dangerous. This could ruin your life. This could kill you. There are very few things that you encounter in your life that could kill you. You don't need to be down there in that reptilian part of your brain. You need to be up in the, in the neocortex part of your brain. I'm going to show you some tips on how to do that in the next video, so check it out.